Okay, today we're going to be talking about some accessories. Um, if you don't want to use an inverter, you can use uh, other things. Um, for instance, I don't know if, if a lot of people have electrical tools like this, but there's different kinds. This is an 18 volt one, and you know, obviously you can use this to run your tools and such, uh, which is very handy. Now, this one is 18 volts. There are some newer ones out that are 12 volts, but I um, took this part from an old uh, tool and made it so I can just put it on the battery and I try to standardize most of my connections so I went to this 12 volt connector and you can plug in you can plug in some things in there you wouldn't want to plug in certain sensitive items but you can plug in these little um, USB ports because they all take up to 24 volts they don't mind and there's all kinds of little USB lights out now. You can just plug this in and run a USB light. Because this is down to 5 volts. There's also one right here. You can plug it in. makes a nice light. And this is a different one. But it makes it very handy to use. And you don't have to worry about the voltage so much. Now here you would, of course. Now I have the other side of this as well. It's, it's an empty battery case and it has wires running to it and it goes to uh, this Anderson power plug you could use different ones but uh, once you find one you can hook it on many things and use it for different items now this is a watt meter it's nice for measuring um, voltage and power and different things I have different connectors with different end pieces you can put on like a 12 volt car adapter like this one just makes the experimenting more interesting and you could hook it to your solar and see how much power you're getting now this one is I really like this power supply I do have it on this 12 volt connector so I can get right into this and run it from 12 volts or from 18 volts from the battery and um, it will actually up convert up to I believe uh, 60 volts or so You can just set it here, the voltage you want, and the current. So from one battery, you can actually go uh, upward. Now, granted, you don't need that voltage for a lot of things, but I use it to charge one of my electric scooters. Um, and this is what used to be a battery pack. So it has a lot of accessories on it already, so I like to use it. Uh, it has a sort of a voltmeter. has a USB output on it. it has a 12-volt output on it. But instead of... Um, having the big heavy battery in it, I took that out and put some uh, supercapacitors in it which are like these, these D-cell capacitors and it will do a lot of items. Of course it has a little light on it it's not that powerful but it works and that would easily run for hours and hours um, and then you have this connector again. So I can just take this connector, hook it to my battery, for instance. I can run my drill on it. I can run my fan on it. And it will run quite a long time. I haven't actually done the tests on those individual items yet.